But what's going on, people? You know who it is. It's your boy, Twix96. People, I know that you were expecting some more of the good shit. You guys can see the title here talking about the new NHL 14 developer diary trailer. Another one. This is the third trailer of the NHL 14, sorry, NHL 14 seasons. So basically, I, I'm not even a part of the loop, I guess. Um, About five days ago, the, uh, the third trailer was released. This one was about the... Uh, the One Touch Deeks, and basically I'm going to go over what happens in the One Touch Deking system. I know that I'm going to keep it real, guys. Uh, this does look like a great feature. Definitely a big upscale for people who actually want to deke and make good deeks. It's hard to make some deeks in NHL 13, 12, 11, all that stuff. But they're taking a big step up and making it a lot easier. But then at the same time, you don't need as much skill to make the deeks happen. So it's kind of a step back. But then again, you're making great plays. You can still connect these deeks together make crazy plays get out of problems it's it's really good so you guys are gonna be seeing a whole bunch of pictures that the ea sports website released here uh, as well the trailer will be down below in the link sorry i'm not gonna play the trailer i'm just trying to i'm not even taking the chance people are telling me that i could post it but i'm not gonna take that chance you know i just you never know guys i know that i've been off the loop a little and i'm actually like six days late I just went on the NHL website today, and I was I was thinking, why haven't I uh, heard of this trailer yet? So, uh, before that is being said, the final four for the NHL 14 cover votes are John Tavares versus Sergei Bobrovsky, and then on the other side, we got Pavel Datsuk and Martin Broder. Um, honestly, I would like to see Pavel Datsuk and Sergei Bobrovsky in the finals, but then again, I, I really in the in the one side, John Tavares and Sergei Bobrovsky, I really doesn't matter who I like to see. On the other side, I want to see Datsuk. This game, it's like changing so much. Definitely with the Deeks being a major part, Pavel Datsuk is the best Deeker in the NHL, no doubt. So I like to, I like, I think Datsuk should have been on the cover of 13 because that would have been pretty sick. Say he's coming down the ice and you're looking at the behind of him, his number's 13. So if it had NHL and they used his jersey number 13, that would have been a crazy background. But um, they didn't want to do that. I think he made it to the semifinals last year as well. But I want to see Pavel Datsuk win the whole thing. But then again, I rather I just out of the three people I want to see Datsuk, Tavares, or Bobrovsky. Honestly, I don't want to see Broder win it just because he's such a decorated goalie. He's got so much, and I really just don't want to see a goalie like him on the on the cover. Sad to see PK was out in the round of 16, but what can you do? So let's start this video out, guys. I'm just gonna read you guys what happened. Basically, the A Sports NHL team is proud to present uh, the first look at One Touch Deeks. At the core improvements made to the true performance skating. So this was uh, kind of both together. How they improved the skating, but now they're improving the deking. So basically, they, they're revamping the whole gameplay. Check out the NHL 14 One Touch gameplay trailer, guys. That will be below. This is going to show you guys some behind-the-scenes footage of the EA Sports uh, technology that they've been working on to make this a good looking game for sure. I just want to see some actual gameplay, and I'll be happy, and I'll be ready to go demo first day. You know me. Experience what it feels like to be a superstar through a new, more responsive deking system controlled with only the left stick and one button. So basically, what it's going to be is you're going to use your left stick. And I saw it when I was watching the video uh, on Xbox. You're going to be pressing your left bumper. On PS3, you're going to be pressing your L1. I'm not too sure how the new console is going to play out. But with that being said, I'm going to be making another video because the new Xbox got released. I'm making another video sometime later this week. Uh, talking about what's happening with the consoles. What what am I looking at right now? So, uh, for beginners to advanced gamers, this system allows a quicker reactive deke and uh, initiative uh, in, in, intitu, intuitive, in, intuitive, intuitive combination deeks, allowing for more moves than ever before. Be careful who you're controlling with the one-touch deeks though uh not everyone has hands like pavel datsuk uh getting too fancy with the wrong players is a quick and easy way to lose the puck basically that's what they were talking about while the trailer was going on kind of sort of you know so these are some of the main points that they talked about when uh the video was playing they're talking about defensive strafing quicker pivots also improved high speed turning uh lincoln 45 degree cuts 
So basically, let's run this down. Defensive strafing, as you guys know, when you're holding down that LT left trigger or L2 on PS3 and you're on defense, your defense is kind of not facing the guy who's coming down on that wing. So basically, what they've done is revamped it. Uh, in NHL 14, it's all about gameplay balance. So they've improved the true performance skating by adding lateral strafing, giving the defensive players as well as the offensive players when coming back on defense the tool they, they will need to have a good, strong defense. The defensive strafing will give you the ability to move your player laterally across the ice while still facing towards the puck carrier. So that's going to be really good. It's going to see that you're not turning away from them and then they get blow by you. But uh, This improves player body positioning. Defenders in NHL 14 will have the better opportunity to make uh, a play by forcing attackers wide than using the poke check, a stick lift, or a well-timed hit to separate them from the puck. So basically what's going on here is they're basically, they're not doing crazy stuff to the game this year, uh, but definitely they're improving 10 times more than what they have. They've already made great technology. They're putting this technology to the next level. By adding all these things, this game will become extremely more realistic, more balanced. Uh, with the quicker pivots, uh, a big part of hockey is uh, using quick changes in speed and direction to outmove an opponent, uh, being able uh, to defend uh, those key moments is especially key and uh, to do that uh, they've improved the speed pivots in NHL 14 to ensure that a player feels more responsive as they skate. Players will no longer appear flat footed while I attempt to stay al aligned with a streaking forward. Um, that's basically just talking more like you know when you're uh, playing defense and you're cutting back over and stuff you want to stay on your toes. Uh, improved high speed turning, true performance skating introduces physics based skating to the EA Sports NHL franchise this year. Uh, it uh, has been uh, further tuned to produce improved balance between speed and momentum. This result is uh, players will be able to make quicker cuts and sharper turns at high speeds, creating greater player response and control. Basically, they're making it a little more enjoyable, a little bit more realistic to play with. Quicker cuts, you know, you're gonna be able to get around players and stuff like that. It's gonna be basically, the, it's gonna be the you're gonna be able to, it's the powers in your hands basically. With the final uh, part here, linking 45 degree cuts, uh, they introduced this in NHL 13 uh, to the true performance skating. 45 degree cuts allow you to uh, quickly change direction and evade the check of uh, defenders. Now in NHL 14, you'll be able to combine 45 degree cuts smoothly in, uh, in succession to evade defenders. There is no longer a delay between each move. Uh, basically, with all this stuff being said, I know that uh, I kind of got to this topic late, but they, they've really vamped up the true performance skating in this game. Definitely took a step up from NHL 13, but it's looking good, guys. I gotta say, the deking and all that, I want to I wanna see a demo. I know that I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure we got about, I think we got one left. I think we have one more of these, uh, I think it's the fighting and stuff. That's the next one, and I think that's it. I think there's one or two more. After that, they're going to wait a month. So I'm thinking, I don't know, I'm going to call this out now. Uh, I'm going to say the beginning of Ju uh, July, maybe? Beginning of July end of June that's what I'm saying maybe there'll be an NHL 13 trailer but I remember our NHL 14 demo but I remember last year I believe it was in the middle of August around there when the NHL 13 uh, uh, the NHL 13 demo was released so you guys know you're I'm the number one source for NHL 14 gameplay news information all that good stuff guys when the next trailer comes out I'll be back I think it's in at the end of the month so that's in like another week, I believe, another week or so. So, oh guys, I'll see you guys next week. Um, I'll give you guys an update on my TV. I know you guys have been asking me a lot of questions about when I'm getting a fix in a new Jake McClain BA Pro. Uh, a galley, you know, I want to get back to those series, guys. I really do. I just can't do it from uh, what, I, what I'm what i set up with right now. So I'll be getting back to you guys with that soon. Uh, as always, guys, you know me, Twix96. Make sure to hit the like the comment, whatever you guys want to leave down below, subscribe, Twitter, all that good shit, guys. So with that being said, I'll also post a Columbus Blue Jackets uh, video today, hopefully, if I have the time to do that. So uh, with that being said, guys, thank you for watching. I appreciate it. You guys know me, your boy Twix96, and I'm out.